How to use Instagram Reels for dropshipping or e-commerce. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can use the Instagram Reels option to create Reels and publish them on the uh, profile that you have for uh, the purpose of selling products from or uh, dropship products or uh, for uh, the uh, e-commerce purpose. Now let's go a little by little by uh, defining the Instagram Reels. Instagram Reels allow you to create interactive videos and add effects and stitch videos together right within the app. There are There is also an explorer page where Instagram users can view different Reels based on the kind of contact that uh, they like and engage with the profile more. Now, what is an Instagram Reels? An Instagram Reels is a feature that a showcase form short form videos content up to 90 seconds. You can record and share these short videos from the app with the Instagram camera or upload existing videos from your camera roll to your Instagram account. By the uploading to, uh, from the camera roll, you can, for example, make or upload a um, mod modified video or a created video from your own, such as uh, these video, uh, these reels that I have created, like this, using only Canva or whatever uh, software for video editing that you want. As you can see that I have created a video with captions uh, that I am showcasing you right now to make them and promote for example my brand or make something like this uh, it is very simple to use or to create uh, instagram reels all you have to do is to uh, go to instagram on your mobile phone then you hit on the create you can't do that or you can't use or create the reels with the pc version or the website version all you have to do i have uh, made a demonstration on how you can use the uh, Instagram creating reels option on the phone. Now we have two methods. The first method which is with uh, the phone itself with the camera of the phone and the th second method is a, a video that I have created using just Canva and made this uh, one and then publishing it with uh, within the reel section. The first step is to go to uh, Instagram and then you go to the camera option. Then all you have to do is to click on the reel section. You can see that it is activated on the camera uh, like the arrow right here. The second step which is this step it is the uh, click on the button or the recording button and put on the clicking or uh, press a long uh, a long press or a long time for the button to record the video that you want and the third step which is the simple step is to uh, release the button or click again on the record button it will show up the video there were there are some steps to do you can modify and make a lot of uh, things you can put some tickets put some uh, everything you want you, uh, you can put some text and etc etc after that you can click on the share to button and we have arrived to the fourth step which is the share option you can click on the share option and it will be something like this you can write a caption edit the cover share the two reels this is the option to you that you have to make now you can also share to feed, crop profile image, tag people and more with the advanced settings. When you finish uh, putting these uh, description and everything in order, you only need to share it or save it as draft. But in our case, we will go directly and share. Now a little point here I want to clarify uh, with the caption. You can, uh, for example, promote a product or make a promotion for a product by making a little description for the product and then you can put the uh, uh, famous uh, call to action uh, step or button, which is not a button, which is a action to do with, from the clients or the viewers which is link on the bio. 
you will go to the bio on the Instagram. This is the bio. Then you have to edit the profile. And after that, you can put the website of the uh, product that you are promoting. And this is will this will be the bio, for example. And the bio itself can contain some explanation. And then they are good to go. All you have to do when you change the website is to click on submit. Uh, for example, you have made the bio description and add also a website. For the website here, editing your link is only available on the mobile version of the Instagram and not the uh, web version. It will be showing the link like this and it will be clickable. So you will redirect the, uh, the clients to the dropshipping store from, for example, Shopify. Let's go make an example. I have this uh, Shopify account. Let's suppose it is a e-commerce uh, store or a dropshipping store. I go to my content or I go to my products. I can see my products are looking like this. I will go with any product that I have. I will select it. Then I can get the link or share the link of my product. Then again, I will go to my profile. Then I will put my link on the website section and not the uh, bio. If you want to use the bio, it is up to you to make the clients uh, make some work which is very boring but it is uh, right to put the website right here then submit the uh, bio and everything will go well the second method that we have is the uh, the uploaded or preset videos that you have made using a software or using Canva, which is like this. I have made a video using, for example, it is a promotional uh, video for a brush, a shoe brush. I have made it with um, uh, making together three or four videos, then making some simple transition and adding my logo to it. You can add a call to action button or you can link, uh, put a link in bio and make the uh, users uh, go to directly to the bio and click the link that was very simple and self-explanatory this is very simple nothing is complicated you have two methods the first method is within the uh, camera itself you can take a video uh, for the product that you are promoting you can talk w within the video then you make a promotion for the video or the second method which is uh, making a video uh, and port it then you can go with it normally this was a very easy and anyone can use this two methods uh, i suggest you i highly suggest you to put a an effort and make a video uh, not uh, just recording a video you can put some cool transitions a call to action button so the viewers can go uh, with the uh, the video for example a call to action link like this link in bio like this this is a call to action i will change its color it will be white this is the call to action that we need to attract the attention of the clients that we are selling something you can put the uh, call to action right here and the clients will go directly to the uh, product page within uh, the bio that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching and see you on the next video